Hi Frindi, hello friends and welcome or welcome back to my channel. So today I have some more goodies from the wonderful Born Pretty. But I thought I would mix this video up a bit and where I've already done the swatching. But I thought that we would do a set of nails um, together. So let's jump in and I can show you the swatches first. So first of all, I have two colours, a blue and a lilac. So let's take the blue and this is CG038. It is a lovely blue consistency, nice and creamy as always with Born Pretty. Absolutely love them and these are... 12 mil bottles as well not sorry 10 mil bottles and they last a 12 month but they're cruelty free and everything and all the ingredients are on the back and this is the swatch has had and um, two two coats and then on the back i did a matte top coat as well as so you can see how it looks matte and then our second colour is CG047 and this is a gorgeous lilac pale purple colour again a lovely creamy consistency it went on the swatch stick like a dream so this is CG047 and here is the swatch i absolutely love this color and i'm going to be using this color in the set coming up and again that's how it looks matte coated so then we have some cat eye polishes you know me i do like my cat eyes so first off it's got to be one of my favourite. So this is Cat Magnetic Gel 56383. It is silver. But look, it's hollow. It's hollow, hollow. Absolutely gorgeous. And again, a dream to work with. So again, that is 56383. And I've done two swatches. I've done a clear and I've done a black. So here you can see, you can really see that hollow coming out. Absolutely gorgeous. Love it. And this is lovely just over the colour without being magnetised as well. Absolutely, yeah, stunning. So we have that one. Next we have cat magnetic gel 56385 and this is a gorgeous gold color and it's actually a jelly gold as well so again gorgeous to work with consistency wise so again 56385 and again i've done a normal and a black version of it and look can you see how that is jelly? It's got a jar to pick up from the camera, but it is a jelly cat magnetic gel, and here it is over a black. See, I could just sit and stare at this all day long. So we have that one. And then finally, we had Super Shine. Cat Magnetic Gel 56340. So this is a plain silver one. Again, this is gorgeous just on top of a nail colour or even as a colour by itself. So 56340. And we've done a black and a clear swatch. And here they are. Look how gorgeous. Now what's good about the um this one, the, the Super Shine 56340 is 
you can turn this into any colour cat eye that you want because it's silver. So you put it down on your nail and then if you wanted to turn it purple, you use a glass or a jelly gel in purple, paint over the top or make, it, make your own by mixing a drop of purple polish with some base coat or top coat. But any jelly colour you put on that will change the colour. Um, so if you really wanted to save some pennies, I would suggest getting this one. Um, because it's so universal and you can change it into any colour that you want. So that's our lovely swatches. So I'm going to move everything to the side and we'll get on with the set. So I have my nail tips all ready. I haven't painted them white, that's just no, the colour that I came in. So I filed off those knobbly bits on the end. So I'm just going to give them a dust and a quick wipe over with some isopropyl alcohol just to make sure that they are nice and clean. Like so. So I'm going to be painting all five using this lilac purple light purple colour which is CG047 and um, I'll show you doing one nail just so you can see the consistency and everything and um, yeah and I'll be back in a bit because you really don't want to see me just painting five plain coloured nails but as you can see the texture is absolutely gorgeous I'm in love with this colour as well. Because it is a light shade, I will do two coats on the nail just to make sure we have a nice even coverage. So yeah, so that is the first coat. So I'll give them all two coats and I'm going to do a matte top coat because I will be doing some painting on top. So I shall see you in a jiffy. So here they all are, they've had two colour coats and a matte top coat. So now I'm going to take three and I'm going to be using the Born Pretty Metallic Drawing Gel and this is the silver one called Cyberpunk and it's um, BPMD02 got a disposable palette and I've got a liner brush and this one is from oh, the gel obsession so I'm just gonna open this oh look how shiny love it so I'm just gonna dip my brush in and pull some out on my palette and now literally I'm gonna be drawing some lines on so like a bit like a like cracked glass foil you know those ones so there's no rhyme or reason on how this is going to be done You can't make a mistake in this, which I love. So to get the paint on your brush without it pooling at the end, pull it on to your brush. But then I like to swirl it in as well. And that just gives the brush a nice coating without yeah, any clumps at the end. And that way you can get some really, really fine lines. But I want these slightly thicker. Like so. And I'm going to be doing this on three of the nails. Yeah, it's just like cracked glass cam marble.
so if you haven't got silver paint gel you could use chrome um or even foil but i just thought yeah i haven't used this paint gel in a while and i thought i'm gonna yeah get it out and have a little play Place number one and i'm just going to do the same now on the other two nails like so so that's our three so i'm going to pop those in to the lamp for a full cure so next i am going to get some crystals for these two so first off look how gorgeous are these these are from vdd and they are a gorgeous almost like a i don't know like an opal but it's like a matte yeah, so these are absolutely gorgeous. So I'm going to open these. Oop, trick. I got um, Allium Gems from Sparkle Supplies UK. I have got just um, your standard here just some um, smaller size of those alien crystals so using some born pretty gem glue i'm just gonna put some of the glue onto the nail in the rough shape of the crystal placement now that the glue is on i am just going to do the crystal placement using a variety of all the stones and crystals that I've pulled out. So I'll put this on a bit of a time, time lapse, put some music on, and I'll see you at the next step. our two bling nails now all that's left is to go over with a matte top coat over the glue and just um, i'm going to use the top coat and butt it up against each of the crystals and that will ensure that they stay in place um once that's done i'll pop it into the lamp for a full cure and then we will be ready for the full reveal And here is the final set. I'm really pleased at how these turned out. I think they are super effective, but so easy to do. Um, yeah, there was no rhyme. There wasn't a pattern. It was just, yeah, whatever. So really um, beginner friendly. And definitely don't be put off by using crystals. Um, it's easier than um, you think. 
sometimes I will have a design and for the crystal placement other times I just wing it and see where my mood takes me but this is the final set so I'd like to say a um, big thank you to Born Pretty for sending me the goodies and um, as you know we had quite a few from them we had three cat eyes and we had um three sorry we had two colors and three cat eye gels i also used the metallic drawing gel as well but um yeah that's everything huge thank you for everyone um for watching and please 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 will you give me a thumbs up and maybe a comment down below because that really does help my channel and if you're not already subscribed then why not no please hit that notification bell and that subscribe button it doesn't cost anything and we'll have lots more easy tutorials and hauls and unboxings and everything coming up but for now, that's everything from me. So it's goodbye. Hoi Laval. Until next time. Bye, bye.